love New York because it allows me to be creative and truly have the world at my fingertips. Fashion has always been my passion, and there is no better place to express it and immerse in it. Well, I have had so much fun going through the Halston collection this morning, and I have to say, super comfy pieces. Yes, my jumpsuit. It's not in this hour, it's in the two o'clock show, but I've already posted the link for you on my Facebook page so you can go ahead and start shopping. Love a good jumpsuit. We have such beautiful pieces uh, from Halston in this hour. Really casual, really comfy pieces. Pieces you're gonna feel polished in and pieces that, you know, are easy. We love things that are soft, that feel good on our bodies, that look dressy but are easy and casual, and that's what this entire hour is all about. Take a look at this beautiful V-neck. You've got the soft, gorgeous knit in the front. In the back, you've got this beautiful, airy panel. Uh, so, so beautifully, beautifully done. And I wanna say hello uh, to my friend, Kim, who you just saw in the video. Uh, and I'm so happy to see Kim this morning. Good morning, Kim! <laughs> Good morning, how are you? I'm so fantastic. I have to say, jumpsuits are my favorite thing. <gasps> so I know it's not in this hour, but I went ahead and put on you know, a, the jumpsuit in the collection, the faux suede, so <laughs> I'm loving it. I love it. You look amazing. You look amazing. <laughs> Thank you. Um, I love that you brought such beautiful pieces. And, and I'm going to say, as a gal who is in menopause and is a walking hot flash, um, <laughs> I loved that you gave me this airy back. So you have the cozy, but you give me the air circulation and you give it to me so it's not going to cling and be suctioned to my body so that you can see that maple walnut ice cream that I ate last night. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, you cracked me up. I love it. Yeah, exactly. But you know what I love about this sweater is not only the movement and the mobility, but let's be honest, we all have like a million sweaters in our closet, especially in Canada. But this one like ups the ante because how many pieces do you have that have a silky woven back on them? Right. So you didn't, you took like a basic piece and you like upped it with a fashion quotient and you have that beautiful blue sun arm. So if you do choose to blouse it up on your arm, you get this beautiful kind of billow that Exactly. I love this whole balloon look that happens on the arm. It just gives so such great pretty. attitude. So pretty. And then you have that little extra protection on the backside because you have the high-low hem. And I mean, I know I like to have that extra protection on the back, but that silk just continues to like elongate back on the body. Yeah, absolutely. And and gorgeous colors, by the way, in this one, too. We have extra small through double XL. Um, the olive is what you're seeing on our beautiful Andrea. And hi, beautiful Andrea. It's so nice to see you. I, lo I love the whole fall of this uh, shirt. You also have the chalk white and you have the classic in the black. It is such a great piece uh, to pick up on. A and again, easy to care for. I, I took a look at it. And it's machine wash and tumble dry on low. I, I will say I hang everything that's just me but but you can even put it in the dryer on low. Exactly. And everything that you're going to see in this hour from H. Halston is all easy care at home. It's all machine wash. It's machine dry. Of course, you can hang dry it. I do that too because I just like to know that, that it's going to be okay. Yes. But I will tell you that we have tested and tested and tested all of our garments and they are so extremely durable that you can wash and dry them. So don't worry about it. And you never have to spend an extra dollar to go to the dry cleaner. So that's it. like a big bonus. I, and I just want to show, there's the chalk white and there's the black as well. I love this pull-on pant. And what I thought that was so great about this is this has a real dress pant look, um, but it's not going to feel like a dress pant. The, the beautiful crepe stretch that this is made out of is going to feel like you're in uh, a loungewear or it's going to feel like you're in your favorite, you know, glam leisure wear but it looks and when you see it on Andrea it looks like a full-on dress pant you've got the stretch elastics you've got the beautiful drape and the side pockets done on a diagonal flat ba uh, back on this and then I saw the price Kim and I thought oh my gosh $59.99 <laughs> ladies you're not going to want to sit in your pajama bottoms when you have a pant that is this <laughs> comfortable and looks this good you don't have to be just dressed from the waist up <laughs> You know, you can actually exactly. put on a pant that feels the same way and is that comfortable. But if you do have to run out uh, or you do stand up, you're going to look presentable. 
Absolutely. You know, this is the perfect pants to migrate out of that super comfy cozy that we've been all wearing for a year and a half, but get back into some more polished pieces. And this is actually an amazing way to do it because not only is it pull on, but this is a four way stretch, yes. which is amazing. So not only does it stretch left and right, it stretches on a diagonal, it stretches up and down. It has a really nice loose fit to it, but still giving you definition on your body. And it's a 29 inch inseam. So it is going to hit right at the ankle. So you're not going to have to worry about running to the tailor because it's so long and you have to take off so much from the bottom. It's really a perfect fit. I'm super petite. I never have to take any of our stuff to the tailor because we really take into account that we don't want you to spend extra money on the garment that you're already purchasing. You know, it's so, you just, I mean, you hit on something that I deal with too. I'm five, three and three quarters. So a lot of, you, you have to get that three quarters in. <laughs> a lot of I times. because I want to round up. I want to be higher. <laughs> I want to be taller, but I'm not. But to your point, I, I love that. And the length on it is gorgeous. So really pretty. Ladies, you're going to love this one. It is I have to say, one of the things, Kim, that I really loved about this collection was some of the sleeves. I love a pretty feminine sleeve. This little dress, it's a faux leather. It has that beautiful kind of mandarin v-neck collar, but you've got this gorgeous sleeve. It's the perfect little length, uh, and we have it in that really pretty olive shade, and we also have it in the black. And this is a go-to piece, and may I just say, before I turn it over to Kim, it is soft on the inside, so unlike a lot of the faux leathers out there, you're not gonna get that sweaty, um, you know, uh, is it Ross from Friends with the, the, the faux leather <laughs> pants? Yes. Like, you're never gonna get that, because this is a soft flocking that is touching your skin. Exactly, this piece is Truly one of my favorites. We actually last year debuted with this as a top with you on TSC. Yes. And we blew out of it. It was amazing. And now we brought back a dress because we're all getting back into really getting a little bit more dressed up. But talking about the way that this garment is actually built, first of all, the faux leather I have this on is so extremely stretchy and soft. It truly feels like butter. But I love that you mentioned the Ross thing because I was absolutely going to do that from friends. <laughs> We lined it in a we lined it in a satin, so you don't have to use baby powder to get it off. Um, but it will not stick to your body at all. It removes that sweat factor, which faux leather can get really warm and yucky. Yeah. Um, but it it literally just lays so beautifully on your body, so you almost feel like you have satin pajamas on on the inside. But you have this really cool kind of masculine fabric on top that, with this whole feminine look, with the blue sun of the arm with the pleating at the neck. I mean, Halston was really about these feminine details. He had a little bit of a masculine touch. Right. Everything then he took and put the detail into it, everything gave it a feminine feel. And this is like the epitome of feminine. It looks amazing with a heel. It looks fabulous with a flat or even think about it with a cool sneaker. And then you can even yes. throw an over-the-knee boot on as it gets colder. Ooh. So this is like so versatile as you take it through each and every season. And Katie's really tall. So where it's sitting on Katie, you know, it's gonna be different depending on your height. Kate, you're 5'9", Katie? Yeah, Katie's 5'9". I'm 5'3 and 3 quarters. So for <laughs> me, when I hold it up, it's, it's, uh, it's touching my knee. You know, so it's, you know, it's, it's actually touching my knee uh, when, you know, if I was going to wear it, whereas it looks a little more like a midi uh, kind of a length on Katie. So, you know, depending on your height, ladies, it's going to be where it's going to fall in, on, on you. For me at five, three and three quarters, when I put that on, it's actually touching my knee. You must be in the same boat, uh, Kim, in, in when you're wearing it too. Absolutely. It's literally like basically gracing my kneecap right now that I have on and I feel like there's great length to it where I don't feel exposed in any way. Yeah. I want to look at the sizing chart because if uh, our customers are new to H. Halston, um, walk us through, you know, size wise. Is it very true to size? What are we looking at? Very true to size. So I would say the majority of the collection as this dress that we're on has stretch in it to truly take your own size. The only time I would maybe question sizing up is if it was a woven blouse and maybe you're a little bit bigger in the chest. Okay. But outside of that, I would really stick with your true, true size. 
All right, um, and I will say, I found it very true to size as well. And, and I have shopped, uh, you know, quite frequently from this collection. <laughs> um, this jumpsuit is, I'm wearing a small, it fits perfectly, uh, and, and it's super, super comfortable. All right, let's take you now. This is a really pretty, we call it a shacket, because it's not a sweater, it's not a jacket, it's not, it's kind of that in-between, real mid-piece that I think a lot of ladies will love. This would be enough for me um, traveling to and from uh, house to, to work each day because I'm a commuter. I don't like a big parka in the car no matter mm -hmm. how cold it is. Mm -hmm. I, I like something like this that, you know, it takes the chill off, but I can still drive and I can still move my arms. Exactly. And it looks very fashion forward. And just like the dress, it has that very soft lining. So again, unlike, you know, raincoats out there or some of the uh, other faux leathers, it's got that softness and breathability so it's not going to stick to you. Absolutely. This is your perfect layering piece topper, as you said, for like that in between you weather, but also if you need to drive in the car because you need that mobility. Mm -hmm. This is that same, I mean, look at the stretch in this. Like when do you ever see faux leather that has this kind of stretch? Right. It's fabulous. And then again, you mentioned it has the silky lining. So again, no stick factor whatsoever. And then your belt is removable. So you really could wear this as, a, as an easy, you know, kind of topper that if you wanted to remove the belt, wear a really pretty blouse or tank and underneath. Open it up. And then you could just wear an open. Yeah. You have so many different end uses for this piece. Look how cute Andrea is. And with all that stress in there, it, it passes the steering wheel test. You know, you can reach your arms around. <laughs> Thank you, Andrea. Uh, for showing that stretch. Andrea and I both are gals that I think that that one's important to us. And I will, I'm just, you know, I'm just going to say it because Andrea and I are cool about it. We both have heavier busts and um, a lot of times things pull on the girls. And so, you know, to be able to reach your arms around and to have that stretch is a comfort that a lot of us are looking for. But then if you are, you know, smaller chested, you don't want it to be too baggy either. So having that stretch, um, really important. Color wise, the silver cloud is what you're seeing on Andrea. We also have what we're calling the all of night. Sizes are extra small through double XL. Andrea is in her regular size large uh, in this one. And I love that you just opened it up because it does, it looks like a really great, almost like a dress shirt uh, layering piece if, if you open it up and don't and don't wear it tied. It's really cute. All right, cascade ruffle blouse. I mean, this is another one. So pretty. You've got the, the cascade ruffle is all done on a diagonal. And this color is called waterfall. And it, and it does. It looks like, you know, like almost like a... Um, uh, an oil painting of waterfalls going down or watercolor painting of waterfalls. It's really pretty, has a very pretty sleeve and also the gathering on the cuff as well. Exactly. So, you know, woven blouses are now becoming a staple again in our life because we do want to look a little bit more polished than we have recently. So there, again, that feminine detail. So you have that cascading, as you said, asymmetric waterfall that goes down the side of the top. What I love about this is it is very, very synonymous with the Halston house for sure, because he was all about asymmetric. He loves things that were off kilter and that your eye didn't draw at exactly one point. So here, literally your eye is going to draw down the side because of where that cascade is happening. And I personally love when there's an elastic cuff on an Me arm too. because I like to push up my sleeves as I live throughout the day. And with that elastic, it stays put where you place it on your arm and you don't have to worry about the bunch factor or the falling or anything. And then the beautiful detail and texture of this fabric that's a double Georgette, it just hangs in such a beautiful feminine way, but it still has that full breathability to it. And I love it here. Oh my God, this look is so cool. But you can see how the ruffle just cascades off the blouse. Yes. So you have that really cool definition to it. So there's a lot of attitude behind it. It's so pretty. The neckline is pretty. The sleeves are pretty. I love the way that Katie has used it up. Now, is this one that you would say, uh, Kim, if you are heavier chested to go up a size because it is a woven? 
Yes, I would. If you're, if you historically always size up in woven blouses because of that, this is definitely something I would recommend. Okay, so pretty. And remember, extra small through 3X. Um, and pieces that you can wash, which we love. You don't have to go to the dry cleaners. Now, again, a blouse for me, I would always hang it to dry. That's just... That's just me. Always read the label. If you're a throw everything in the dryer gal, you're okay. I like to hang to dry. It's just my thing. All right. So uh, uh, very often we do host picks. I'm going to say uh, this is a crew member's pick right now. Keisha loved this one. She said, this is so pretty. Um, this is the faux suede that I have on in the jumpsuit. And I'll tell you, May I just say the faux suede, when you think of that very often, you think heavy and stiff. It is like butter. And, and I'm going to pull it on the ground because I want you to see mm -hmm. just how velvety soft and airy this is. Do you see how that puddles? It puddles because mm -hmm. it is really fluid, soft faux suede. It's not going to be hot. It's not going to be sweaty. I'm in the same faux suede. Y'all know me. I'm the menopausal hot flash mm -hmm. girl. And I wouldn't wear it if it didn't breathe. <laughs> <laughs> you know, one huge thing to note before we even talk about this item is Halston pioneered Ultra Suede. He was the one who put Ultra Suede on the map. And if anyone, I'm sure a lot of you have watched that popular series on a popular streaming app right now that's based on Halston's life, there is a whole scene in there where you see how faux suede came to life. He had a model in a, in a suede dress. There was a massive rainstorm, and he was like, oh, my God, you can literally only wear this when it's beautiful out. Like, why are we restricting? Yeah. He took this fabric, and he made it where you could wash it, dry it, and it has the look of suede, yeah. but it's so much more breathable and airy. So and this it stretches. Is, this is <laughs> and it stretches. I mean, it's amazing. Like, this is Halston. If this piece and the jumpsuit you have on, hands down, they embody Halston through and through. I, I love this classic. It's like, you know, it's like the t-shirt dress that's been, or the shirt dress that's been upscaled. Um, and so you've got the button down, beautiful sepia color, extra small through double XL. And yes, machine wash, tumble dry. Uh, and wait till you see again do you see the price on the 79.99 on easy pay it's $19.99 my friends which is i mean an absolute killer price when when it comes to something and the fabric's going to last like andrea you know standing in there she's it's breathable it's going to last for years if you care for it well it's going to last and last and last wash after wash Absolutely. And that's what we all want from our clothing now is that we know we don't have to sacrifice fashion or durability anymore. And this will, this will be one of those mainstays in your closet, especially for fall and winter that you will constantly go back to. But there's actually so many other ways that you could change up the look of this dress. You could absolutely remove the belt. You could put on your own belt if you wanted to give it a whole different yeah, attitude. Like an elastic you could, belt or... Which I love, and it look, will look so cool. Or you can leave it unbuttoned. Really get that 75. <gasps> I you know, like if you had a legging and like a mock neck and just leave that unbuttoned yes. and open, that would be gorgeous. Oh my God, it would be super chic. So you could almost wear it as a jacket as well. So yeah. it has all of those multiple end uses to it. Look at this pretty blouse. This is the India ink. Uh, then we also have this gorgeous olive tone that is so pretty as well. This is such a beautiful blouse. And, I, you know, I'm going to show you the India ink, but I'm going to actually pull the olive forward because I think <laughs> you'll see the details clearer when I put my hand through here. And you can see there's like a little peekaboo opening in this blouse. You'll see it better on Katie. And then there's another peekaboo uh, opening at the back beautiful neckline with this kind of like twisted knot detail up at the top and full button-up cuffs. This is gorgeous. This is hands down my favorite blouse from the whole entire collection and I am a blouse girl through and through. 
This piece, let's start at the neck because it's so interesting, this detail. But this, I call it, it's like almost on a little pulley. But this detail, you could actually expand it out so you would cover a little bit of that cutout detail if you wanted it to be a little bit more modest. So totally up to you. Once it's on the body, it really lays flat. And then the back of the neck, I love because one big feature that we always do is we always put those stretch buttons on the back of the garment. Because if you think about it, how many times have you, have we broken a sweat trying to close a button on the back of your neck? <laughs> yes. And then it makes it so much worse. And I'm like, why will this not go in the buttonhole? This is so easy because it literally just slides in. But the volume on the arm is like spectacular. It's you so really pretty. have almost. Oh. Even like that bishop look, it's so pretty. You need a with glass that. of wine in your hand with that blouse, oh. don't you think, Katie? Like it, it needs to be holding some champagne. <laughs> Absolutely, and you need to be going like somewhere absolutely fabulous in yeah. this top for sure because it is a showstopper. This is your charcuterie board and wine top. <laughs> is everybody yeah. hungry now? <laughs> yeah, exactly. It's true. But you know, you imagine if you're on a Zoom call or on something like that, you look so polished and and pretty and feminine, but. It's airy, it's comfortable. This is another woven, so again, if you are really heavy busted gals, go up a size. Otherwise, go true to size. Absolutely, 100%. And you know what I actually just thought of? You know, we're always thinking about the details to add to the outfit. Because of this neck detail, you completely eliminate the whole concept of having to add a necklace because yes. you have all of that detail already. So you have a full look by just putting on this blouse. So pretty. I love the little peekaboo. I love the little cutouts. I love the peekaboo in the back. Thank you for giving us stretch buttons <laughs> at the back of the neck so we're not fighting with it uh, to get it done up. And did you notice the jogger that Katie had on? This is a faux leather jogger. Super cute. You've got, you know, um, the slide pockets, you've got the little tie, you've got the elastic waistband. You also have it at the cuff, so you can wear it down. Or I love what Katie did, and she zhuzhed it up to show off her ankle booty. Um, and this really, this takes glam leisure to a whole other stratosphere, doesn't it, Kim? <laughs> Oh, it does. You said it so well. It really does. Because joggers have now become a staple in our life in full transparency. So there is no reason why you have to delete them. This gives you the really cool fashion element, but you are still so extremely comfortable. So let's just remind you that it is lined in that yummy, silky satin. So this would be an awful Friends episode where you would have to use baby powder. I don't know if anybody watched the reunion show. Did you, did you watch Watch the reunion oh. show. Oh, they ha they replayed and replayed that Ross yes. baby powder full leather pants <laughs> episode. I was like, that's my favorite episode. But we don't want to wear that, do we, ladies? We don't no. want the baby powder. And thank you for uh, for uh, you know H Halston for always giving us the soft inside that you know is not going to stick to us. <laughs> Exactly. And these are full of oodles of stretch. But I love that there's enough gather on the hem that you could ruche it up on your leg and it stays and it gives that attitude and you can show off your cool footwear with it. Yeah. But one fabulous feature is, you know, our cell phones are stuck to our hands all day long. All pockets on H. Halston, we make sure that they're cell phone friendly so that your cell phone fully fits in it without falling out. So that is also another great detail that you maybe not have to throw on a bag for that day. If you just throw your keys in your pocket, you're running out, your cell phone, it's really easy and it'll lay flat against your body so you won't even see it. Now Katie has them zhuzhed up. You can pull them down so it sits down at your ankle, my lovelies. Uh, but I love the way she's got them kind of zhuzhed up with the little ankle boot going I mean that is just such a chic look um, and I know you're asking are they machine washable yes they are you can even tumble them dry again I would hang them that's just me do you hang things Katie or do you throw yeah Katie's a hanger too Andrea do you hang that yeah I think um, I think most of us ladies because we know that our clothes last longer when we hang mm -hmm. them right like we like that they're gonna be fine in the dryer. It says so on the tag, on low heat. <laughs> but if you want them to last longer, just hang them to dry. And they, they dry really fast when, it, when you hang them too. All right. Absolutely. So cute, so cute. Uh, this jumpsuit, by the way, I have put 
the jumpsuit, and I've also given you a link to buy it. It's on my um, Facebook page and the link in my bio on Instagram, so I made it really easy. It's coming up in the 2 p.m. show, and we have it in a couple of colors, so uh, do check it out. It's so comfy. All right, this is also so comfy. This one is so cute. It's that beautiful brushed fleece. It's done in a tunic length. They have this gorgeous zip in the front and a beautifully constructed zip. So if you're a gal like me and you just need to kind of vent things, <laughs> I always need to <laughs> vent myself. Um, you know, I would wear a little tank top underneath and then I would be able to vent. Uh, and then it also has the beautiful beautiful pockets with the snap detail and just like a lovely tunic kind of draping cinches at the sleeves so it's going to fall it's going to be comfortable it covers your tushy it covers your tummy uh the perfect perfect layering piece it really is the perfect layering piece and it's a really cool modern way to do a sweatshirt or a pullover yeah. and it, it really is, and it's not your dummy sweatshirt that we all would probably have a million of at this point, but I love it because you can layer a really fun top underneath, and you just open that little peekaboo zipper, and again, you have breathability, but you also can pop through some detail on a shirt, yeah. but the brush or you can wear it on, on its the own. inside. Like if Absolutely. You, if you don't want to, you just leave the zipper up, and you're good to go. Absolutely. And that brushed fleece on the inside is so delicious and yummy because it is so soft. Mm -hmm. It truly feels like something you would throw on your bed. Um, and then these pockets, these fabulous deep pockets on the side with your little functional snap there that just gives it an extra little kind of fashion pinch. And then, of course, that fabulous elastic on the cuff. So you can ruche it up very beautifully and it'll stay put on your arm where That's you, where you place it. That's the soft inside. Can you guys just see how yummy that is? And then you've got the beautiful, oh, ladies, this is cozy with a capital C. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. It is beyond cozy and it and it's and it's cool and modern and you can run to the grocery store in this, but you could also go out to dinner in this as well because there's a great way to dress it up. You know, think about it. Put it back on with those fabulous faux leather joggers that we just showed. Yep. You could do like a little half tuck in the front and give it a little bit more attitude, ruche up your sleeves, and no one has to know that you're super comfortable because you look so on trend and so in fashion. Yeah, what a great piece. I mean walk the dog go for a walk in the forest <laughs> with the leaves when they change <laughs> color my that's so, it's so pretty isn't it to do that and of course you want to look good because you're going to take photos when you're walking in the woods <laughs> with the leaves changing color I mean who doesn't take photos so you want to look cute right you know when you're walking across in our area uh, Andrea and I live in the same area and it's like you're walking across the area uh, and they've got the little bridge that you go across and the leaves are changing in the background and and I mean just so cute. They're the pieces that you look for <laughs> sitting on the dock at the cottage, cuddling up Friday <laughs> night on the couch with your honey just watching movies. Um, they're the pieces we love. We also have fallen back in love with our joggers and this is the mixed media jogger. I'm gonna pull it forward in, uh, this is a this is quite the name for a color. It's the Heather Reflecting Pond. <laughs> <laughs> I really? know, it's a mouthful. It's, it's a mouthful, kind of I'm a sorry petrol, about that. It's like a petrol kind of color, ladies, if I was gonna describe it. Petrol or teal-ish. Is, is what I would say with the black heathering in there. Absolutely. It's definitely very teal in the sense. And you have the mixed media of fabrics because the waistband is... Um, is satin so you have that really cool detail your pockets are satin and then you have a tuxedo stripe down the side of satin how many joggers have you seen out there that really has that mixed media sense where it's dressing it up with a satin tuxedo and then you have that cuff that is full of rich satin as well but the ruching and gathering down the side of this as well gives that really awesome look, especially when you ruche it up on your leg or if you leave it straight down. Mm -hmm. And then again, it's a brush carry, so it's super, super soft against the skin. Oh, but I love this because this is a great way for us, if we're going back into the office, to take that really casual look, but make it socially acceptable now. Because as I said, joggers are part of our life. They're here to stay. But you can throw this on with a great cashmere sweater 
sweater or, you know, a knit sweater. You could throw this on with a turtleneck and a really cool leather jacket and a sneaker. And you are really put together, good to go. You're socially acceptable in an office. And it looks like you really thought about your outfit, but you really yeah. didn't have to. Absolutely. We're going to see it on Andrea. And I know she'll show us both the legs both ways just so that you can see, you know, nice and down and relaxed. But, you know, like Katie did with the other pants, if you want to zhuzh them up and blues on them a little, you know, wear it with a cute ankle booty, wear it with a little pump even, I mean, or a flat little sneaker, a pull-on. I mean, there's so many ways to wear a jogger like this, and you can get such a, um, such a variety of looks from very casual to, as you said, office appropriate or dressier. Um, can you pull it back down for a second again, Andrea? Because it almost looks to me like a dress pant. It doesn't look like a traditional mm -hmm. jogger. And I think it's that tuxedo stripe and the mixed media that kicks it up a notch and takes it to that next level. Absolutely. You you have that more refined, polished look because of the satin here, because of the ruching, because of all the seaming detail. It's, again, that seaming goes all the way down the back of the leg. So it's going to, with that seaming, it's going to elongate the leg. It's going to add some additional definition. Your waistband, you know, I want to point this out because I feel like a lot of us deal with this when we buy bottoms that are yeah. pull-on, is that your, sometimes the waistband rolls rolls inside the right. elastic, which is really, really frustrating. This is sewn down on the inside, so that will prevent it. And then your little drawstring in the front will really help hold it in place. And we tabbed the drawstring as well with some really pretty little gunmetal tabs. So it will not fall through the pants at all and you won't lose it. I just had to look at what fabric this was because I started touching it. And I'm like, what is this? This, I was like, I was like, what is this fabric? It is a beautiful blend, and let me tell you, it feels softer than cashmere. It is soft, it's cuddly, but um, it, it, it's almost silky soft in a knit. It's hard to describe, but ladies, when you get it at home and you feel it, you're gonna say, oh my gosh, Renee's right. It, it kind of feels like cashmere with a silky touch to it. Uh, it, it it's really delicious. There's a substance to this fabric, so it feels very high-end, very chic. It's a double-faced knit turtleneck sweater, and it has this really relaxed neckline. And Katie came out in this one, and she was like, yeah. And then she looked over at me, and she said, this would look good on you. <laughs> I was like, thanks, Katie. <laughs> It's so pretty. I, this sweater is off the charts. This is hands down my favorite piece in all of fall from the collection. One, because this reminds me of a very expensive Italian designer that puts out pieces like this for two and three thousand dollars, which is like absurd in my opinion, but you have that beautiful yummy hand here that you described it so perfectly. It's cashmere like, it's silky, it's soft. Mm -hmm. This is a turtleneck that you can put on and look so extremely polished. I think of this turtleneck and we'll have the bottom next, but in like an appreciation sense like this is your perfect outfit that you want to look really pulled together but comfortable and it looks like you spent a lot of money on the item this is your perfect it's piece. very and very is... high-end looking and feeling uh, both yes. and, and uh, yes. you know and I looked at the price I went it's really only $74.99 when you feel it when you look at it when you get it at home you're going to say, you're right, like this fabric just feels very rich. It feels very sophisticated. So the two colors, the India ink is what we're looking at, Katie, and the other color is what we're calling heathered cinder that's kind of a cross between, I want to say, a gray and a taupe, uh, somewhere in the middle of that, which is a gorgeous neutral uh, that you can pick up on uh, as well. We also have the matching pant, and... The pant is so pretty. It has this beautiful, almost palazzo-like leg at the bottom. It's not quite as wide as a palazzo, but it's pretty close with the ribbing detail. And it's a pull-on, and it has a flat back on it. Mm -hmm. I mean, this takes knitwear in a, in a pant to a whole other level. 
Oh, it is so chic and sophisticated as a full look. I mean, the knitting and the waistband detail with that texture and then the hem with that texture as well, that ribbing detail, I love that this hits at the ankle. Again, you will be able, you will not have to hem this. You will be able to wear your perfect shoe sneaker with this looks super put together. This, in my opinion, is like the chicest look that I would see some like amazing Italian woman walking down the street. And it looks like she, it took her hours to get dressed, but she probably really just threw it on. This, when I've worn this, that is like what I feel like that I'm embodying. Like grab my espresso. People are going to look at me. I can throw a little fedora on and you just look so put together, but you're so extremely comfortable. And I have to tell you, I have been trying to find additional colors because we didn't do black and I've been looking for a black pan out there like this. I ordered so many and I get them and they have that they don't disclose to you wool in them that I have to like literally rip them off my body right after because itchy, they're so right? itchy, yeah. so itchy. There There's is no, no wool, wool in, in this. No. So there is no itch factor whatsoever. Yeah. I, I get the itchies from a lot of fabrics and I also, you know, as I've said, and, and I'm okay to say it and I say it because I think that we need to talk about it. I'm in menopause, I get the hot flashes and uh, for any of the gals going through it, it is not fun. And so <laughs> you're really fabric sensitive and, and a lot of the, uh, the ladies too, and I think a lot of women, whether you're in menopause or you're not in menopause, we've become very fabric sensitive. Um, I think that, you know, if one thing in the last uh, year and a half to two years has taught us is that we won't sacrifice how we feel. You know, we have to do those little things like having fabrics that feel good on our body. We're not gonna wear the things that don't feel good anymore. We need to do all those little things that make us feel good. This is a fabric that will make you feel good, but best of all, it looks so rich. It looks so high end and it will feel that way too. May I please just say how, I, I, I use the word bougie because to me it describes it very <laughs> perfectly. I know there's some people who don't like that word, but I love the word because it does. It's high end, it's bougie, it's sophisticated. Um, it, it feels very expensive, but it's not expensive to buy. And I love that, that you know, H. Halston is bringing us pieces that look so fabulous, but the price points are for the everyday woman who, you know, is on a budget and has just paid all their college and university tuitions and then bought the books and then bought the computer. It's okay. It's okay for you to do a little treating of yourself, for you to feel good too, and for you to, you know, feel like, ah, this is this looks comfortable. I look good. I feel good. That's what H. Halston is doing uh, for you today. How about a hoodie? Who doesn't want a new hoodie in their collection as we go into fall? Don't we love hoodies? Like they're always a favorite. But I don't like a hoodie when it looks sloppy. I like a hoodie when it looks kind of polished and put together, you look relaxed, but you still look pristine. Exactly, and that is actually, this is absolutely what this hoodie does. But I love that this hoodie has a half zip to it. Mm -hmm. So again, it has that little attitude and we gave you really great definition with piping that almost kind of like splits the garment. So there's really a great way for your eye to draw. As I mentioned, Halston was never into your eye drawing to one place. He wanted it to draw everywhere. Um, and that's exactly what this does. So again, you could wear a fabulous little tank or tee under this. You could absolutely wear this fully closed it is a yummy yummy soft brushed fleece so i'm um, sorry a french terry and french terry is a fabrication that we for sure can wear 365 days a year because it is so extremely breathable because of the way that the fibers are woven together it's not a hefty 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 french terry it's a beautiful cozy lightweight french terry mm -hmm. uh, which i think a lot of us like you know we don't want it to not breathe. We don't want it to be too heavy. Um, we love the feeling of French Terry. It's like that sweatshirt that you've had since high school that still has your <laughs> alma mater on it uh, that you've washed a million times, but it still feels good when you pull it on. It's that French Terry, you know, when it just lasts forever. It's high quality. Uh, and I mean, look at how cute Andrea looks. Like you could be going off to the cottage. She could be going, uh, you know, um, out to lunch with the gals. 
uh, you know, walking the dog. I mean, there's so many things that, that you know, we wear these pieces for, going to see the kids play football or, uh, you know, their outdoor activities. Exactly. This is like your perfect versatile piece that you can bring into your closet for fall. And it's going to be a mainstay and an item that you will probably go to on a weekly basis. Because if you think about it, all of us really subconsciously only have 10 pieces in our closet each week that we constantly go back to. Yep. And it's great to refresh them, but we need those core building blocks that you can truly just grab and go or build around. And this is one of those pieces. Well, really comfortable, really easy to wear. I like that you can zhuzh up the sleeves with the elastic. I like that half zip. I even like the waistline, how it's giving you a waist, you know, with the, the piping detail, but then it floats. It floats around the hips, it floats around the tummy, it floats around the, the tushy, so nothing's clinging to us, and it just, you know, it's gonna be that perfect, perfect piece. We also love great joggers, and um, these joggers are so cute from H. Halston. Um, we have two color shades, and they've got a little bit of a texturing, or, or like a, I must want to say an animal feel to them with a little bit of a, a leopard kind of a print. Yes, it's almost like a snow leopard print, yeah. which is really pretty because animal is something I swear that everyone loves. I don't think I've ever met anyone that doesn't love an animal print. And this is a great subtle way to do an animal print um, in a feminine way. And so you have those light, you know, you have the light option and you have the dark option and there's easy top options that you can put back to these. So, you know, on the, the gray and the white and cream one, you can always throw it on with like a gray sweater, a gray t-shirt, any, and even, even white face back. Exactly. I love that. And it looks so cool together. I love that. Um, with the mixed media, but these again have that really nice, actually modern jogger leg to it. There's a really fun cuff. So instead of having that typical banding that you would call a jogger, this is just a little bit more clean of a detail, but it's still going to do the same thing and, you know, hug your ankle in the right way. And if you choose to ruche it up on your calf as well, it's going to stay put. Right. It, yeah. And a nice pull on, uh, you know, detail and a little bit of that tuxedo -y striping down the side, uh, but easy pieces. And I'm looking at it on Andrea and she's got a little ankle booty on with it. And it goes over because of that wider cuff, it goes over the ankle booty. Uh, so if you did want to wear it that way, um, but you know, you can wear it with your runners. You can wear it with your little flat pull-ons. Uh, it, it's just, you know, it's comfy and that marbling, that marbled leopard, uh, you know, is such a, I don't know, high-end detail. So we've got it in what we call the pearl blue and then the India ink. The India ink is the uh, deeper one um, and uh, Andrea has on the pearl. Uh, size is extra small through double XL and machine wash, tumble dry, all done in really easy uh, to wear pieces. One triple eight, 2020 triple eight is our toll free number. And again, I remind you the cute little jumpsuit that I have on in the faux suede. I have posted the link for you on my Facebook page and I posted it in my bio on Instagram because I know you guys in your jumpsuits, you're like me, you love a good jumpsuit. Uh, and we've got it in several colors. It'll be in the 2 p.m. show, but I thought I'd give you a jump ahead and you can start shopping now. Um, I think we're all looking for those real athleisure pieces, glam leisure pieces, pieces that, you know, we can get away working in, but still, you know, feel like we're working from home. I know y'all were working with your nice top and your pajama bottoms. For me, it was like shorts. I was wearing my shorts <laughs> and my nice top on all my Zoom or Teams calls. Uh, walk us through the sizing again one more time, Kim. Absolutely. So sizing is absolutely true to size. Be confident and, and, and take your true size. And the only time I would suggest uh, sizing up is if it is a woven blouse and maybe you're a little bit bigger busted because there is no stretch in it. That would be really the only time that I would recommend sizing up, but otherwise stick and take your true size. Oh, absolutely. And, and you know, I'm in my regular, I'm in a size small. I feel really comfortable <laughs> in it. It's not too, it's not too tight. Katie's in a regular small. Andrea's in a regular large uh, in all the pieces that you're seeing today. Here is a beautiful, uh, again, we, we, the fabrics are soft, the fabrics are breathable. And so we're looking at this top and it's a very lightweight 
French terry. So a little, uh, a little less nubbly. <laughs> is that a word? <laughs> if it isn't, I just said it. A little less nubbly on the inside. <laughs> I think when I say it, you guys know what I'm saying though when I talk about French terry. <laughs> so it's a little smoother on the inside, but it's a beautiful weight. You've got a nice rounded neckline and the detail on this with the little bit of the knot detail, it gives it almost a bit of a tulip type of a hem on this. I think the easiest color to see it in is gonna be uh, the more gray uh, taupey color. Yes, and I love this little twist front because that gives it that whole kind of high-low hem detail or almost like the half tuck that has really become like, it's not even a trend anymore. I feel like it's a staple in our lives. So we've kind of taken that whole, you don't have to half tuck it yourself. We did the little twist knot for you and gave you that little high-low hem detail. But the fabric detail, as you mentioned, it is very lightweight. It, I like the way you use nubby. It, there is no nubby feel within this French carry. It is very, it is very smooth against the skin. But look how awesome this looks on. I mean, again, it has that kind of asymmetric sense to it that Halston loved and embodied. So here you have that it just comes right up in the center. It almost has where it falls so beautifully over your hip. So yeah. nothing's grabbing, which is so nice. Nothing is So you is could wear hugging. it with like a legging, like a, you know, a tight-fitted yeah. legging if you wanted to, and it would be so appropriate. The color that you're seeing on Katie is what we're calling the camo chalk. We also have the camo India ink, which is that blue. And then we have the classic solid navy. So if you don't want the print, we do have it available in the classic solid navy all right let's take you to another beautiful french terry and this is more of that funnel neck so a funnel neck ladies is it's not a turtleneck it's not a mock neck it's a little bit wider uh and you know easy to get on and off it doesn't cling to your neckline this one here beautiful diagonal stripes uh, or seams where the uh, sleeve is really a nice relaxed fit and then it's got this beautiful zipper detail at the side, so you could open it up on one side if you don't want it, you know, pulling when you're sitting around your hips. Exactly. I love that detail because I feel like it gives great attitude also. And if you had a really fun top on underneath, it could peekaboo through as well. But I love the way that you described a funnel neck. And I also think about it as it almost kind of puddles the way that yeah. it sits on your neck in a really good way. Um, you know, cowls were something, and this is not a cowl, but it's a version almost of in the cowl yeah, family. The cowls tend that, to have more fabric, right? Whereas this has less Exactly. Fabric that same sort of drape Exactly. And cowls were something that were so synonymous with the Halston house. You could have seen them on so many different items and collections that he did. But here, this took a basic sweatshirt and you gave it a real fashion presence yeah. because of that neckline, because of that exposed zipper detail on the side, because of where it falls in terms of length. So it does have that tunic-like length to it. But then the fabric is just so yummy again. This is French terry, but it is a really soft, and I have to tell you, it, it is has so soft extremely nubbles. lightweight. <laughs> it has soft nubbles on it. Um, <laughs> it's so lightweight. It's really cozy. It's almost, you'd want to throw this on as a blanket. Like, that's yeah. truly how soft it is against your skin. So some French terries can be a little rough and tough. This definitely has a silky soft hand to it. Soft nubbles. <laughs> <laughs> but I know I'm saying that and you're all like, Renee, that's not a word, but you all know what I meant. You all know what I meant when I said that. <laughs> we, we need our own dictionary, our on-air dictionary. You know, it, you know, we try really hard to describe feel and, uh, you know, because we are your eyes and your ears. And so we, we try really hard, um, to, you know, to describe exactly what we're feeling. But, and I hope that most of you know what I'm talking about when I say that. But I think you did. Like, when I say nubbly, yeah. you know what I mean, right, Andrea? And I felt it, and you're right. You felt it, and I, she goes, and then I felt it, and I'm right. <laughs> so, uh, uh, just amazing. I like the length. I like the little zipper. It's just really, really cute, uh, you know, easy to wear. 
everyday top that will be the one that you grab. You know, we all have those ones in our closet that are our grabbers, our go-tos, like, oh yeah, I just mm -hmm. wanna wear that today. Don't have to worry about ironing. Don't have to worry about wrinkling. It's gonna look Sorry. great and I'm gonna, you know, I'm gonna be comfortable. Speaking about being comfortable, Oh my gosh, now what is this fabric? Because let me tell you, this is light, and this I would describe as, if you've ever been on a cruise, and you've been in those <laughs> stores uh, where they charge you like $180 for a t-shirt made out of that bamboo fabric that you love so much, that's the hand and the feel of whatever this fabric is to me. It's that super soft, super breathable, I want that touching my skin lightweight fabric done in a gorgeous front seam jogger with the diagonal pocket. I also love that the front on it is, a, is more of a flat front with that, with that tie and, and even the cuff has that beautiful softness to it. I, I cannot describe how soft this is other than to explain it the way that I did and I hope that you have the picture in your head now. <laughs> the fabric is like ridiculous. I, it feels like a mix of butter. It feels like a mix of silk. It almost feels like a little mix of that soft faux suede that we had earlier, but you yeah. have it on in the jumpsuit. It is just so extremely heavenly, yeah. lightweight, breathable, but there is so much texture and detail to this. I mean, this seaming that comes down the front, it adds such amazing definition to the front of the leg, where then you have that jogger hem that you could, again, ruch up on your calf if you wanted to. You could leave it down, wear it with a great shoe, not necessarily a sneaker. You could wear it with a booty. I love the clean elastic on the waist. Again, it's so an inside so it won't roll over as some of us have experienced in the past with other brands but the feel of this is something that should sell you on this when you get this home you are going to hit yourself and be like I should have ordered the other two colors because this comes in three colors because it is so yummy and you are this is going to be one of those 10 pieces that I mentioned every week, maybe even almost every day that you're gonna wanna put on in some sense because it is so heavenly on the body. Aren't they comfy? And like, isn't that fabric so soft, Andrea? I know, I, sometimes you touch a fabric and you're like, yes. <laughs> <laughs> that is this fabric, yes. You know, that's the best way that I can say it's just soft, but it's, it's, it's lightweight while still having a density to it that's not sheer. You know, because we like fabrics that breathe and are lightweight, but I don't like it when a fabric gets so lightweight that it that it's sheer. Does that make sense when I say that? When you can see through it if you held it up to the light? There's enough density that you'd never see through it when you hold it up to the light, but it, it is soft and puddle worthy, uh, you know, on the floor just to make it, you know, just pool and be beautiful uh, and machine washable. So absolutely gorgeous. Kim, thank you so much. I will see you again thank at two you. with the jumpsuit. Yes. You look amazing. I can't wait. We're going to have more fun. <laughs> uh, don't go anywhere. If you want to start shopping the jumpsuit, I've already put it on my Facebook and my Instagram. You can go ahead and start ordering.